I'm from Mexico. And when I moved to Germany, I was culturally shocked. Nobody smiles, people are cold, nobody owns me a Mexican smile in Germany. So what if I changed my way of thinking, and then once I stopped looking for it, I actually was able to see German people smiling at me in German, in their very German way. We all put on this maybe artificial personas every day. People just writing an S-Bahn wanting to go unnoticed, unnoticed. But then all of a sudden, to have these communions, you have to let your guard down a little bit and, and then be willing to just be who you are. What I like about celebrating New Year's is that everybody feels like there is a new chance to start over. I love the fact that we all had a role to play in the evening. Ines was very much so worried about the food, Julia about the social aspect, and I about the, the space and making people feel welcome. There is something so innate to, our, to my culture as a Mexican woman. It's just, that's what we do. We want to feed people and, and you come to my house and if there is one egg in the fridge, we'll make it last. Once I get to meet somebody, once I get to make the first connection with somebody, I want to know who they are. Sometimes you find yourself talking to people about things that can be very profound, and sometimes you're talking about how you grow tomatoes out of a windowsill. What I really, really like about Berlin is that everybody has a place here. People are, are not trying to be anything they're not. Berlin is chaotic in the best way possible. When I'm down the street in the middle of this crazy chaos, I feel so free. I feel like anything is possible in those experiences. It's as if you've never seen a rainbow before and then once you experience it, you can nobody can take that away from you.